Good morning everyone, Simple Mom. How's everyone doing? Welcome to Friday Motivational. Today we'll do a little different. I also will do a get ready with me at the same time to kind of like chit chat um, with you guys. Um, and talk to you guys about something that's been like on my mind somewhat. Um, so it's Friday. Woo -woo. We made it. It's, for me it's been a long, 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 long week. Um, I decided today, I if you guys follow me on a regular basis, you guys know that I am um, doing a Jessica Smith challenge, and her her um, challenge or her workouts are only thirty minutes. And I've been working out for quite some time, and thirty minutes doesn't cut it for me. I mean, I tried it for the first you know two weeks, and I know my body's like, okay, lady, give me more. So today I started to do. I just did one mile with Leslie with her um, new program, Miracle Miles, which is absolutely amazing. I usually moisturize my face with the aloe vera before I put anything else in my face. Um, and any time that I walk with her, as far as um, miles, it, it gets me thinking and it gets me going um, to the point that You know, anything that's really like bothering me, it, it surfaces and I start thinking about it because it kind of like I let my mind kind of just go. And um, so I am sitting there walking with her and I say to myself, you know, there's so many different situations that I wish I can change that I know I can't change. You know, as much as I would love to, I know that I can't. So what do you do, you know, when you have a situation that you can't change? Um, and you also can't change people, you know, because that's one thing we can do. We can't change some situations and we can't change people. So I get that. I'm fully, fully aware of that. I get it. When it comes down to what you are able to do and what is under your control is how you react to the situation and how you decide to go about it. You know, depending on the situation, you can either decide to just walk away, make it better. Um, it's completely, completely up to you. So, with that said, you kind of have to look at things with positive attitude. And if you can't change a situation, then what are you able to do so you won't feel so discombobulated, um, feel like this is not here. Um, so looking at things in a positive way definitely helps me stay in tune with things, you know. Um, life is not easy and sometimes, you know, we wish things could be a little different. But like I have mentioned before, we have no control over people what they do and what they choose to do even with ourselves um i know that when i was told by the doctor you know you're borderline diabetic and you're borderline well pretty much i did have high blood pressure um it scared me it scared me so 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 much that it shook me because my kids are my life and to even think that me myself can do something to make sure that I'm here for them for as long as God allows me to be here I want to be here um, so this is why I took my nutrition and my fitness to a different level 
and there was no excuses whatsoever like mm -mm. I needed to do what I needed to do and I did it and that's that like with me you know growing up I have mentioned before you know something so small as sunflower seeds I used to love sunflower seeds and the fact that because they're high in sodium um, I had to cut them, you know, out of my life, and I did. Um, pizza is one of the things that I love the most that I needed to give up. Um, you know, I completely switched around my entire eating habit because it meant that much to me for me, you know, to be here for my kids. Um, so, you know, definitely kind of like switch, you know, it pushed me into where I needed to go. Um, so one thing is not being able to change a situation, but how about the situations that you are able to change that you have full control over? So why not, why not change what you're able to change instead of sitting there, you know, concentrating on the things that we are not able to to change whatsoever. So I, my divas, challenge you this weekend to just take inventory of your thoughts and what's going on in your life and make a list of what you're able to change and what you're not able to change. And the things that you are not able to change, let it go. Deal with it as possible, you know, as possible, positive as you can. And those things on that list that you are able to beast and have full control over, make sure you do. And concentrate on what you are definitely able to change and change it for you so you can take care of them that's always been like my biggest model you know take care of you so you can take care of them and I'll go back to the um, analogy that they use when you're in a plane you know you have to First, save yourself so then you're able to help save someone else's life. And in this instinct, you know, my husband, my kids, they are my life. So definitely, you know, got to do it for them. So, you know, I'll leave you with that thought. You know, change what you're able to change. And what you're not able to change, you know, stay positive with it. And take it from there. So I'm going to go do this nappy head of mine. <laughs> I need to wash my hair. But um, I hope you guys, you know, can take this and if you can apply it, apply it. Um, it's just that simple. And it's just, you know, keeping it real with yourself as far as where you stand. So happy Friday. I hope you guys enjoy this. Get ready with me. Something simple as you guys can see. I'm not no makeup guru, but it's enough to so I don't look like I'm half dead. <laughs> God bless you guys and we will see you tomorrow. Bye.